Sean Puffy Combs' latest lawsuit, New York, WABC. Leah Graves was 25 years old and dating an executive at Bad Boy Records in 2001 when she was summoned to a meeting with Sean Combs, who honored her after she was slammed face down onto a pool table by an associate, Joseph Sherman, according to a lawsuit filed Tuesday in New York. The lawsuit is at least the 12th civil suit filed against Combs, who has pleaded not guilty to racketeering conspiracy for sex trafficking and prostitution charges. He has denied allegations contained in the civil lawsuits. Graves alleged Combs and Sherman gave her a drink, likely laced with the drug that eventually caused her briefly to lose consciousness. She woke to find herself bound and restrained. Her lawsuit, lawsuit described a violent S.A. Plaintiff could not believe that the defendants would record themselves committing such a gruesome crime and then proceeded proudly and widely to disseminate the recording of it. She was distraught, distraught and sunk into a deep depression, the lawsuit said. At a news conference next to attorney Gloria Aldred, Graves told reporters on Tuesday the assault decades ago has greatly impacted her life. Emotionally, she explained the trauma of the assault has taken a toll on my mental health at PTSD depression and anxiety, and the emotion you start has been hurt. She said violations she experienced has had lasting impacts on her body and causing ongoing health problems. Allred said Combs has a video of the R and has shown it to others and has sold it as P. Their goal, according to Allred, is to hold Combs responsible and to achieve justice. They want damages for physical injuries, emotional distress, psychological harm, anxiety, humiliation, pain, and suffering, social and family disruption in amount to be determined at trial, along with other damages and relief. Latest on Sean Puffy Combs. You're going down, guy. You're going down, and you deserve it, guy.